as my son stole his PlayStation 5. It was his. I, I think. But he took it and then he beat it already. So I should be able to get it back. I also should just get it. So anyway, uh, we're playing Sonic Frontiers today because... Face that isn't weird. Face uh, isn't weird. I'm gonna pick a purposely weird face. Going live on YouTube. Playing Sonic. Here's. Um, and here. Oh. Let's do it. Are we live? Oh, you are live. Oh God, so... I've been live. <laughs> Hold up. You just uh, I'm you just posting. went live, I'm and I'm laughing. Uh, I, I'm laughing at my own uh, my own work in the thumbnail of you running along Sonic. <laughs> I haven't seen the thumbnail. I need to check that. <laughs> Hold on. With a big bright smile on your face. Oh God! Why didn't you show me this beforehand? Oh, I gotta jump into my 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 me account. I completely forgot to even uh, show oh, yeah. you. <laughs> I saw like a little flash of it. Oh man! How's it going, guys? Well. Let's see if I'm in the frame. I had a little bit of a rough week. Oh, Austin the Hall's here. Remember three months? Oh, hello. How's it going? Well, guys, had a little bit of a rough week. Ever wake up from a deep sleep and think of a cringe moment in your life? Like, and you like lay awake in bed. Damn it, did the game just quit? No, that was probably me leaving Team Viewer. Well, I had one of those this morning. I woke up at 60, 6.30 this morning and I was like, oh God, that DDT on the apron. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so let me explain what happened. I actually pitched that spot because I loved I love that she does that, but we couldn't practice it in my ring because the ropes were too loose. So, um, and then we couldn't practice it when we got to the arena because there was these big cages. So everybody was like, I'd taken DDTs before, but I'd never like helped anybody over the floor. So like, they were like, okay, you got to have your hand here on her leg and her other hand on her hip and you're going to guide her over. And, guide, and, they, and everyone was like, so focused on like, got to guide her over you got to guide her to the floor that it was literally all that was on my mind when it happened and so we went over i was like guide her and when she was down i was like oh fucking ah just go to where you're supposed to go <laughs> so yeah i fucked it up because i was so concerned with keeping somebody safe and a lot of times when you see me do something the first time it's the first time i ever did it it's the first time i ever did it i was really concerned with keeping chassis safe and i made it look bad and you know what I'm sorry okay Fucking shoot me. Apparently, I deserve to be fired or burned. It, it reminds me of uh, Body Python, the Holy Grail, and they're like, Burn her! 
I'm like, well, what about, you know, there weren't calls to fire anybody when, like, Madcap Moss and Big E were spiked on their heads, and they're like, burn her anyway! Like, I'm so sorry that I was so concerned with keeping someone safe that I made the look, look bump look bad. Um, but what really bummed me out was my favorite thing in matches is turning around a hostile crowd. And uh, we're in Boston, so of course they're hostile because, you know, they're angry at the fact that they live there. And uh, right when we got them, like, turned around with the holy shits and the crossbody into the fans, of like, fuck yeah, we're turning it around. We got all the awesome shit coming up. And then Shotzi rolls me in the ring, and they're like, get out of there. You gotta be, they're basically like, plan B, get out of there. We're out of time. You got to go. I'm like, what? And she was, like, going up, and I'm like, Sorry, girl, and I had like run up and throw her down and throw her in the pipers and armbar and get out of there because that's what uh they were telling me on the on the mics because they were I guess the match before us went over by like six minutes and they were really concerned about going over on time and the match after us was like a three way so they wouldn't be able to communicate with each other. Hold on, I'm a little foggy to be able to make the match shorter. The match after that was horror ga war ga horror games. <laughs> it was horror games after that. They couldn't cut that out, so it was like the only place where they could get that time back. So I was kind of bummed though, because we worked on that match for two weeks, and we were really excited about it. And um, I felt like I really kind of like failed Shotzi. I really wanted to like showcase her shit and make all of her shit look great and show everybody how great she is. And that's like one of the main reasons I want to come back for this run is like showcase a new talent and show people thank you Aiden Door. you're amazing and um show everybody how great you know Liv is and Shotzi is and Raquel and Shayna and showcase all these women that haven't been getting the attention that I think that they deserve and uh I feel but that wasn't the match that was like the beginning of the match and I'm kind of bummed that we're getting judged from what not really what we put together and why was the match so short, asked JC. Uh, just for time. There were both the War Games matches are going an hour. So uh, they're worry really worried about fatigue at the end of the night. So they were, I mean, I never heard anyone so, heard everybody so stressed about time as I was leading up to that pay per view. So we literally only had eight minutes to do everything. And uh, when we hit the eight minutes, they're like, I gotta go, and I'm not gonna like argue, you know, because they sh pay me to show up and do what they tell me to do, tell what they say to do. So, kind <sighs> of bummed though. I feel like I failed Shotzi. Oh, sorry. I'll do better. I'll do better. I'll make it up to. I'll beat her ass. I'll let her beat my ass in a way everyone loves. No. Beat each other's ass in a way everyone loves. I don't know. Oh, Morgan the Messenger says, Screw the haters. Also getting my squiggly squid sign made for 20, December 28th in Greensboro. <laughs> Let's fucking go. Aiden Door, thank you for the donation. And Bailey, I'm doing great, actually. Um, because my life isn't. I woke up to next to my beautiful little girl this morning who was biting and sitting on my head and farting into my ear. And I thought, <laughs> <laughs> I'm very grateful. What, what am I doing? Oh, what am I doing? Oh. I still, oh, the game is still in the game. Holy shit, it's loud. All right, I turned this off while you guys were, I was playing this game. Um, let's turn this down down. But yeah. I think it's kind of funny that there's calls to fire me because I made something look bad. I was so preoccupied with keeping safe. But other people in the back of the neck. Their careers. Not. They're blue about it. Okay, how do I... God, how to do everything. Oh yeah, I was in the middle of like battling that coding guy. Okay, I remember. Okay. I'm kind of in the middle of the situation. How do I run again? Oh yeah. It's Sonic! You didn't even know how to run. There we go, that's the boost. Alright, I gotta get on this guy's little trail there. The pink trail, little snail trail. Ooh, 
one year anniversary since following Delissa. Oh wow. You're always going to be in the middle of something in this game. That's true. Um, fun fact, Rhonda. Tomorrow is the Video Game Awards show. And uh, God of War Ragnarok, Elden Ring, all the favorites are up for Game of the Year. Um, but a certain game leads overwhelmingly by fans' choice, and it is yeah. one Sonic Frontiers. Really? Yep. This is There's beating a Ragnarok. Uh, it's like a whole thing where the ah. entire in internet is uniting behind Sonic. Ah. They feel it. They feel uh, Ragnarok will get its just like just dudes oh. in every other category. Do you believe that I missed that? Well, I'm definitely not getting Sonic as just dudes. <laughs> but I was actually playing this game and thinking like, oh, this is really. Art and Hobby Channel, hello. There is a stream planned for Raid Shadow Legends that is extremely addicting and we'll be making an announcement very soon. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, have you guys played Raid Shadow Legends as my character? I have played the game but not as her yet, but I heard she's overpowered and Where do we, we're gonna need to go get this guy. The thing that sucks is it's kind of like vacation. Not very good at vacation on game. Why is he coming down? He's like going, there he is. Aha, maybe I can descend. Oh, can in here. Hey, babe. Here we go, let's go. I'm getting there. I'm gonna get him. Ah! Ah! Stop, stop, stop. Oh, damn it. I didn't do it. Uh, um. You know what? This game is oddly satisfying. Yeah. Yeah. I, I like how it's continuous motion. You know, like once you get on a roll. Morgan says she should take me to sushi before the show. I don't really eat that much before I perform in this problem. Oh, come on, cheater. I don't see the. Do you see where those things are? I heard they shot I'm gonna build it. Okay, I'm just gonna have to slow down whenever he shoots the ball. Going down. All right, let's go. Keep me up. In a, you got it. Right. 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 Feeding up again. Right. Sonic the patient. <laughs> when is Knuckles coming out? I'm in it for Knuckles, man. You make Travis wear like sneakers and big white gloves. Yeah. On your hair and big red dreadlocks. Oh shit. <laughs> right now I can't get hit at all. Damn, you really can only get hit once. Ducks. Oof. Because you lose your rings and then you can't like go back and get them. Fine. That was not fair. You saw I was changing lanes and it was on the right. It like hit me in the middle while I was going on the right side. That's bullshit. That was bullshit. Wait. Get this. Wait. I said start right here, so it's kind of nice. Like Alright, 
It hit me once. I don't think I'm ready for this guy. So if I have no rings. Alright, he kills me one more time and I'm just gonna move on. Yeah, I if, if I lose my rings before I even get there, and there's no way. This is me on I'm dead. So I got this. Here we go. Here we go. Wow. Uh, oh, dang it. I, mean, I had to do it again. I guess I wasn't hitting them enough. Oh, I did some damage. Oh, man. I got hit. I'm basically dead. Throwing fireballs at me while I'm doing the loopy loops. I'm blurry. Oh no, I'm not blurry. You're not no. blurry. Yeah. Sorry right, guys, I'm kind of focused. People hate Tails? It's funky. Tails was the best invention ever because it was the way for your younger sibling to be able to play too and not give you a hard time. Oh no! Never mind. I think I kind of flash. Alright, come on, Sonic, can you do it? Ben Rye in the chat room. Hope everybody's humidity is good. <laughs> oh shit! Yeah, guys. Temperature, two point humidity. We need to know. Thank you for keeping us honest, man. Dang, this thing is loopy looping me. Let me get it. Damn it! Oh, I'm dead. Oh, I'm I'm out of here. I'm gonna just collect some stuff. Your blurries is in there. <laughs> I'm not doing this quick. If I do this all day, and I don't want to do this. Okay, come on, let's do it. Oh, squid. How do I stop this song? I want the ethereal music of Sonic. <laughs> there we go. Stop it. It's this little circle. Nothing? Maybe I should do a circle around next. Wind speed! Chris wants to know the wind speed, guys. Can you go in that circle like a hand like a hamster wheel? Ooh, maybe. Oh, oh shit! Go sad. Did you yeah. like, do some research on it? Not at all. I, I just see things and I meet. Uh, it's my first reaction to any type of circle. Maybe that's a hamster wheel. <laughs> <laughs> You're a rad dude. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, man. You're pretty rad yourself. <laughs> oh, beef stew. Uh, I was. At I, I, I was actually looking at um, a, a package of beef stroganoff at the store, and, and I thought of all the rowdy ones. So that's Aww. kind of it's changed my life forever. Who is, hold on a second. Um, Julie Wanda Hair says, hello from Albuquerque, New Mexico. It's 115, 47 degrees. Thank you. She says, it's a good time to be Poe when it isn't. And she won all of her matches this week. She's had seven wins and two losses. Congratulations. Ooh, well, there's a ooh, ooh. Oh, I'm fine. Ooh, ooh. This is for you. Congratulations. That's awesome. 
hundred dollars. Oh, dude, you have nothing to make up for Austin. And he says to make up for not donating on other streams, left Twitter for a bit due to constant BS. I hear you there, but I'll be back in there, dudes. Don't delete anything. Your retweet of mine, lol. Yeah. <laughs> Girl, I always love and support you. You're so sweet. Oh my god. Thank you for supporting the chickens. Um Oh, the chickens. Which, is, what? So uh, no defense you Rossi, but you'd either you'd fit either Knuckles or Shadow and the Hedgehog more than Sonic. No no no. I definitely want to be Knuckles. No offense taken. I I'm very much complimented. What were you what were you saying? Um, I'm gonna quickly link the routing ones to grumpseekers.com because we now have chicken. Oh yeah, so our chicken is now available. Yeah, so our um our chickens, which um we never went to get into the chicken business. We we're literally just in the land healing business. And uh we're trying to raise our wagyu regeneratively. And that means we ah, I didn't know that I was gonna up before I died. Um that means we try to actually the land that we're raising them on instead of tax it. And so we used our cows to suppress the carbon, carbon by uh, rotationally grazing them and um, keeping the grass from being short all the time. So, like when you. Oh. Um, when you keep the grass short all the time, it doesn't really. Um, have the opportunity to go through its like full growth uh, cycle and its fastest there it is. Ah! its fastest stage of growth is kind of like in the middle stage so um it's always when cows are like allowed to openly graze they don't um the grass never gets out of that slow growing stage and so if you allow the grass to go accelerated growth it all the way along um the roots are going to mirror it on the bottom. And the roots are made out of carbon in the atmosphere. So when the cows eat the grass, the long grass off the top, and it sheds all of those fibers to mirror the land. And all of that carbon that was used to make roots is now deposited in the soil. The idea is that we do that over and over and over again um, to, to sequester tons and tons of carbon um, every year with the cows. Um, and the idea is we're trying to build the soil and make it healthier. And so the chickens are there for the soil and to help the cows get uh, the best grass possible and, you know, guys the best meat possible. So, um, our schooners, which are the ones that are going to be, or which are available, you can buy them. We raise them two weeks longer than people who raise birds and, um, so they have more of like a chicken taste, but it's not gamey. It just tastes amazing. And um, we keep them out on pasture in like a shaded, like like a schooner enclosed area, which has like food and water and everything for them. But they can also still, you know, have grass and dirt. And, and um, they poop 300 pounds into like that small area and eat all the grass down to the nub and eat all the... The, um, in, like insects in the area, and you get the minerals from the soil and everything like that. And um, then we move them to an, another spot the next day. And so they, then after the grass has been stressed out like that and has all this poop mixed in, it's all short. We let it sit until the next year. Then the cows um, come on and graze it, and it's supposed to make it a whole lot um, healthier for the cows. And then we're getting layers that'll come in after like be out in the open pasture with the cows that will be going through the poop by large be laying eggs, but, um, all of your donations, thank you are going to be going towards our layers project. And if you want to support our schooners, you can, um, sign up on uh, browse the acres, try some of our regenerative chicken. And we're trying to save the world with regenerative agriculture. It looks like Barry Tibbin says he's getting a Build-A-Box of chicken and steak right now. Oh my gosh, thank you, man. That's awesome. Oh yeah, I mean, then, the thing is, we never thought to... We, we, we're not raising chickens to, to raise chickens. We're, we're really uh, raising them to help the soil. And so um, they're kind of like a byproduct. Kind of so if you're, you know, 
we're, we're selling them because we're, we, we need them to actually heal the land and make it more productive and, and better for the local wildlife too. It's really cool. We have, we've seen like antelope and all the time people in there. What? Oh, okay. <laughs> I love you. Miles B with the ten dollars. Thank you for supporting Brad's Bacon Cheeky. Uh, I mean, I think it tastes amazing. It's great for, it's good for the earth. It's humanely raised, happy chickens. If you ever want to check out uh, Brad's Acres, raise the chickens. Um, you're welcome. But um, uh, yeah, it's basically we raise chickens to make our the oil in the grass more healthy for cows, but. We want to make fighting climate change cool. Oh. Thank you. So to be cool with this. What's that? Um, as for speaking over you, Tan Ara, that basically I hope that explains where the donations go to, is helping Rhonda save the world, and then you are a little bit too. Uh, which is a perfect segue, segue into Ashton Banks for $99.99. Jesus! Ashton Banks, $99! Hey guys! <laughs> Supporting Brazzy Acres. So our main ranch is actually in uh, South Central Oregon. So we have the majority of our, our animals. Question about Oregon. Uh, do you have ticks up there? Uh, yes. So the, the chickens do help with that, huh? Uh, yeah, actually. Um, like, they're, like, the scooters are concentrated in like, a small area, not like, um, not like a big thing you can check out in the area. Yeah, I'm getting them, I'm getting them, getting them, getting them. We hit the ones that die though, but no trouble. Oh, I was close though! Oh my god, I'm gonna do it, guys. I'm gonna do it. Okay. Now I'm freaking noticing. What were you saying, Jason? Sorry, chicken? Uh, sorry, I was making a poll. Um, I want okay. to just address Barry Tibbin, who says I need my box autographed. Uh, depending on where you are, don't threaten uh, Ron and Travis with a good time, because if you go to the Browsy Acres YouTube, you can see Travis literally hand-delivering a box to a customer um, who just happened to be on the route between the farms, the ranches. So, it's quite a business. Yep, and Trav a lot of times, um, yeah, we'll make um, customer service calls himself, and sometimes I get to join. Well, I, th I think our Browsy Acres community is like one of my favorite communities. I mean, the rowdy ones, definitely, you guys are number one. One of them. Browsy Acres community is really cool because everybody just knows the animals, and kind of like all I really want to talk about, you know? <laughs> it's like gaming and animals, so cool. Um, my other question to you really quickly, Rhonda, is do, does Sonic, by sprinting through the grass, does that sequester carbon? No. But, so it has to be digested? Uh, it doesn't have to be digested, but it needs to be, like, cut, I guess. Well, Sonic is tearing up this grass. He's going so fast. I mean, just compacting it? I mean, I, I, I didn't need to see the sign. Oh, there you go. Right. Don't greenwash oh. Sonic, okay? I don't know what that means. <laughs> it's like this new, like, edge phrase that, like, people are using for You have to think that Sonic isn't pushing down because he's going so fast. I think he's got to be tearing up the grass. Earrings. I don't know. It depends on if he's wearing cleats. Oh, we got him at half HP, and we have four rings. Yeah, it's true. But the cleats—they don't cut the grass. They actually aerate the soil. Maybe they don't <laughs> help. Cleats. Open some holes in it. But he's helping oxygen get to it. 
Oh, another thing too that's great about having the uh, grass long, which we're kind of learning with our pasture this year, um, is we're leaving it long in the winter, not letting the animals graze it, uh, because I guess the sunlight is directly in the soil, like the UV light or radiation um, is bad for the microbes. On the uh, <laughs> it's magic grasses, Barry. Uh, what was the poll? Andrew Thomas goes, Nice poll, Jason. There's no Easter Bunny, it's just a guy in a suit. What was the poll? <laughs> uh, the poll is, It's not a schooner, it's a sailboat. <laughs> and then the first question is, Shut up. The second mm -hmm. one is, A schooner is a sailboat, doo doo head. Three is, What is this? And four is, Small rats, old school. Schooner is a sailboat? I think the uh, schooners are the name of the kind of chicken. Uh, kind of chicken I know. for meat are called schooners. I'm right. just referencing broilers. broilers. The, the the structure that they're in is called the schooner. Um, it's a line from Mallrats when Ethan Supley, who has lost a lot of weight in his life and taken on more dramatic roles, um, is trying to see the Magic Eye book, and he's like, "It's a sailboat." And, or he goes, it's supposed to be a schooner. And he's like, ah, oh, it's a sailboat. And the kid goes, a schooner is a sailboat, dude, dude, head. So I don't even know if that's true. I've just been repeating that line for 25 years. I don't know, but I'm keeping an eye on this little worm. Yeah. <laughs> oh! What? Oh, all right, close, we're gonna get there. No! No, Sonic, no! No, 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 we got away from me. Whoa, Nahum Dr Dyer says if you do an infinite symbol with the Psy loop, Sonic gets infinite boost temporarily, so I guess it's not infinite. Oh god, that was bad. That was the worst infinity symbol. Hold on. <laughs> oh. You got a little you got a little bonus. Was that? Is that it? There it is! He's right! Thanks, dude! Who's cool. that? Simon? Nay, uh, Nahum Dyer. Nahum Dyer, thank you. I'm boosting. I'm boosting forever now. Ooh, where are you? Oh, this is one of your wheels. Uh, Ben Rye, the, the schedule for streams is on Baby Po time, so that's right now. Usually Tuesdays and Wednesdays. Wednesdays, I gotta pack usually when we leave on Thursdays. There we go. I'll back this guy a little bit, feel better about myself. Come on, guy. We need to do, guy. Everything. I'm getting better at the battle. Oh, okay. like, like that. Like when those guys are happening. Cool. I like that. Holding it too long, that's a problem. Ah! I, I gotta stop trying to like fit as many hits as possible in and cut it out in the bunch of things. So I'm messing up with the other guy too. Damn you. That's a child. Copy. Beautiful. Wow, I still got the boost! Woo! Here. Here. I like this game. Good, like, eight in the game. Goodbye, go. Harriton. Harriton? He's gotta get back to work. 
It's my favorite horror movie, asked Josh Mendez, 28 Days Later. Oh. That touches on our current poll. You've returned. Do you need an insight once more? Allow me to unlock the power of seeds you've gathered. Oh yeah, lots of stuff. Defense level raised. Power level. Yeah, oh yeah. Oh, I'm gonna kill that freaking I'm tired of looking under the tree. What is that Pokemon that kind of looks like? Not Kyogre, even though it does kind of remind me of Kyogre. Keeps going. Or not. Remember, there's no fall damage. Where did that guy go? There he is. Okay, yeah. I should just stay in the same spot that I know he's gonna come down, but wait for the end up taking longer. Trying to head him up. Okay. What what is he doing? One of a bee. Jumped on. There are two of them? There's two of them! Now there are two of them. <laughs> now there's two of them. Damn, what is that from? Oh, really? Yeah. Star Wars Episode One. Which part? <laughs> right in the beginning when uh the 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 um uh, the Trade Federation aliens are looking at the beginning of episode one and in the oh, go. Oh the two agenda. Jedi's. Yeah. What? Right. Now there are all two of them. <laughs> right, that's what it was. Yeah, I knew it was Star Wars, but I couldn't place exactly who said it. Oh, shit. I'm doing well, Eric Diaz. Thank you. Here. Are you shooting at me? Look, I got a new ramp though. Maybe it'll help me catch that dude. A lot of maps. What's that guy with the thing over his head? I don't know. Oh! What? Miles, I think, is right because I think it's when, uh,. The Emperor introduces Darth Maul, my new, my new apprentice, and then they go, no, there are two of them. Oh, they that go, was it. It was the two Sith, ah. not the two Jedi. But it's like right next door, because Obi-Wan and, and, um, Qui-Gon, Qui yeah, Liam Neeson. 
are are next door. They're like they're on the ship. It's it's like the next scene. It's intercut, man. It's an inner guy. <laughs> what I got on the thing the first time. Should I just wait for it? Um, uh, shell he's feet. almost back. Yeah. Stop chasing it. Is Kronos Island on the Klingon homeworld? Oh God, it's a deep cut. No, Sith, not Jedi. So no, she's right. <laughs> Wait, what? Sink her phone. Oh, I got it. I got it. Julie Wonder says my mom's mad at me because she asked me to sink her phone and I threw it in the ocean. Because <laughs> it would sink. S I N K. Ocean, ocean is so epic. <laughs> yeah. Here we go. We're doing it. All right, freaking guy. I'm got powers and whatever now. I mean, Sonic on you, Rainbow Road ass. Eric Diaz, I've already gotten around this Christmas gift. Oh God, I haven't gotten like yeah. anybody's. I do not require anything. I, I'm here to make you blush. <laughs> oh no, I went right into the fireballs in the beginning for no reason. really like uh, Chris's comments. I love when it's dark and cloudy and you're zooming and loop-de-looping. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Michelle Feek, I have 13 pounds of sauerkraut fermenting in my kitchen right now and it's starting to smell. And so that's what I'm going to be doing for Christmas is putting all that into pierogies for my family. Wow. That might be like and... the most Polish thing I've ever heard to say. <laughs> that says a lot. A resident Polak. You know what's funny is my sister, me and my sister Jen are both a quarter Polish. And then she married a guy who's like entirely Polish, so it's like really funny that her kids are more Polish than anything. <laughs> yeah, little Polak children. Love potatoes. <laughs> they just love potatoes. <laughs> oh, come on. Stupid thing always gets me. So far, I'd sent her a jar of this art. Go, Sonic, go! It's almost dead! You have 87 pawns! Girl! Alright, I'm gonna stay in the middle. The middle is my default lane. He's almost dead. Frick, frick, get him! A boost come back. Yeah. So cool, you can so fast. Uh, I got some. Let's go, Rainbow Road Booty. Oh, God. Ah! I had to get him that first time. Ah! So, Fig eats you and your sour <laughs> percent people are over zombies. Mm hmm <laughs> Sure, Julie, because every night I have a hard time remembering something, but then it comes on me. Oh, come on, dude, I was like mid-jumping. You better not fuck up. Oh, God. Let's go. Let's go, guy. Boost, 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 boost. 
should have done my infinity boost while I was waiting. Sorry, Miles, I failed you. I'll do better next time. In the middle and go back to the middle. Okay. Stay in the middle, move back to the middle. Back to us. Miles forgives me, I'm gonna do everything. I'm gonna the world is my <laughs> freaking oyster peanut. I don't know where the peanut came from. Where's that oyster peanut? Peanut? <laughs> oyster peanut! Oyster peanut, what the is that? Is my peanut! <laughs> Is that a real thing? Is it it will be peanut? now! The world is your peanut. Hashtag baddest dream on the planet. <laughs> Sonic is on it! Come on. Ah! ah! Don't jump! Oh god! Why did I turn into that dude from Lilo and Stitch just then? Should I stop and go fishing? Richard also hates sauerkraut. Hey. Dude, Chris has got a final coming up. <laughs> I say to myself, the world is my oyster peanut. <laughs> oh, hey, Sonic. You come here to fish too? <laughs> Big, what are you doing here? How did you get here? What even is here? What is Sonic's nose? Look at this. What? <laughs> yeah. Look at this nose. Like, I've never really looked at it front on. I, I... What? That thing did like, get caught in the window. How phallic his nose is? <laughs> but you went there. Oh, man. I'm going there. Well, no wonder the pink hedgehog likes him. It's like double trouble if it. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> The pink one. <laughs> What's the pink Sonic? Oh my god. Mindy or something. Yeah. Pixie. <laughs> okay. I don't know. I was looking for fish oh, trouble. and wound up, so now I'm fishing. Well, this is my oyster peanut. Oh, it's never going away. <laughs> you manipulation nation. <laughs> I'm not a pervert, Maybe. okay? I'm a happily married woman. This makes me think of these things. Of course you are. Would you like to try? <laughs> I'll let you borrow a rod. Eh, Sonic doesn't need to borrow a rod. <laughs> he doesn't. All right. Uh, you know what? We're evil, Tear. I'm going to have a great day because you helped my chickens out. Thank you so much. Eh, I guess it wouldn't hurt to de This is a cool little a soundtrack, though. Chris is like, is he rapping? I'm like, well, I'm about to with this sick beat. Gonna lay down some real slow and romantic, like. It does sound like he was a rapper. With your phallic nose, I'll lend you a rod, though. Don't, I know you don't need no one of those. I'm off the beat. I'm back. I'm back. Ponic. Rapping. Uh, Enjoy this lake with my friend. That's big. He got big. Handle. <laughs> Do you know okay. how to fish? Fire. Coming up next on Boiler Room. That should be hashtag fire Ronda after that one. Fucking fired. No, that was awesome. I'm fired. Like... I'm firing myself after that song. Fucking fired. Oh, man. Oh, it's so tough to be guessing. Feminism that makes insecure. Uh, you know what? Listen, Rhonda, they could do it better. What? Do what better? 
you know, all, uh, everyone on Twitter, they, they could they could definitely take a, a tornado DDT from off of the map better. <laughs> uh, I'm going to take this DDT better than anyone on the fucking earth some other time. <laughs> I'm going to spike my head, do a fucking breakdance spin. Men land face first onto the mat. And then while I'm bleeding onto the ground, I'll be like, Are you not entertained? And then they're going to no, be like, <sighs> Fired. <laughs> you did the, but the thing is, is no one even remembers that you did like the most beautiful, clean ass DDT with Shotzi in the match previous with her. Yep. Yep. You, you riled me up. Dude, that's what it's fucking like being me, though, man. If you're, like, committed to accidents and being perfect. I just want to be perfect! If the second that you're not perfect, everyone's going to lose their goddamn mind. It's like... You know? Like, I missed... I think the only, like, botch I really, like, oh, cringe at is uh, when I missed slapping Ruby Riot. And then, like, the WWE, like, made, like, reaction videos of everyone reacting. Going, oh, God, Ronda messed something up. Let's all react and laugh and make a big deal out about it. Like, Jesus, you guys, like... Looking like a little bored, you need something to talk about. You gotta fucking shit out all over my tan suit. Hey, you got a fight, <laughs> son. I got that. Thank you. I think in the wrong context of people who don't understand that, I'm gonna be like, what the hell? First off, Rhonda, I've never seen wearing a suit. Why is she wearing tan in winter? And why are people pooping on it? Fire. Oh, Rhonda. I miss these streams. Fire! Can you see the red and ripples? Oh, that's an R. I, God, I would love for you to come out in a tan pantsuit on Friday. <laughs> I'm gonna trust the crowd. Oh, man. The light ripple overlaps the red one. Lift your rod up quickly. Okay. Everyone's putting the color tan now. Yeah, put the color tan in, in the chair. room. <laughs> <laughs> You monsters! You animals! This is a, uh, this is a society we live in. Organized society. You nice cat. If you get plenty of tokens, I'll trade Dip Frog. He really likes those purple coins. All right. Uh, get treasure token from Big by catching fish. When Zama gets accumulated a good amount of tokens, head to trade tokens. Trade them for items that will aid in his adventure. A gold card is an item that can be exchanged for one of the items on the list and carefully about which item you use. Okay. Would you like to try? I'll let oh, we you have to pay to go rod. fish. I want to return to the island. <laughs> Ben's uses 100% game to make Sonic hand colored. I don't know, man. There's gonna be a lot of involuntary celibates that are gonna be very, very upset with you and they're gonna fuck <coughs> What? You wore your tan suit again? <coughs> That's like how I picture like angry tweets look like. Like someone like sweating hot pocket onto their phone or like <coughs> Fuck you! You should hide in a hole and never do anything again because I need some company in my hiding hole. <laughs> we'll we'll not hole. stand for this hot pocket slander. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> what? I didn't know that after the sauerkraut you were like going for the pocket. No, actually, that's not true. But, you know, um, pierogies are uh, the original Hot Pockets. I did not know that. Well, I mean, they aren't really. They're kind of like the original ravioli, I think, because I think they came before ravioli. You think there's all kinds of, like, pastafarians that are, like, arguing the order of creation of pasta? Dude, there's people on Twitter that are calling for the firing of people that are making pierogies the right yeah. way. They're, <laughs> they're hunched over. 
fire, cancel pierogies. There was, like the Great British Bake Off, there's so much stuff. Just... Oh no! Oh! Oh! That's it. I'm going up here and I'm gonna do the thing that Miles told us to do. Nope. Uh, with the infinity sign. And I'm just gonna wait. This mother for him to come back. It's all the way over there. Okay, fine. Well, now that I have some extra time. Oh, fuck <laughs> you, Brookie. Rhonda's character is overpowered. Huh? All right, he's almost here. All right, just enough time. Fuck you! Hashtag. I didn't realize that this was like a real live thing that you had to wait for. Yeah, and look, it like froze. That's right, I got it. I like went to do this little screen while I was midair. Now I got my infinity boost. What are you gonna do now, motherfucker? I'm armed with the knowledge <laughs> of miles. Knowledge of miles. Knowledge of miles is one of my overpowered abilities. <laughs> they are complaining all about it on the forum, so it makes everybody. Oh, on raid? Were you reading? I was watching some YouTube videos. Oh, that's hilarious. Because there's many videos about how overpowered you are. I just want to let you know. And oh I unlocked God. you. And, <laughs> He's the worst. Yeah. No, no, they're like, holy crap. He's oh. the only person who can do this. And Rhonda, you can ignore, like, passive abilities. It's great for bosses. Um, that's basically me ignoring, um, the fucking... Haters? Haterade. See? That's one of my superpowers. It's, it's, it's completely... No, factual. Ignoring shit is something that I'm great at. <laughs> I was thinking about you uh, sauntering because you can't say walk about you. Like oh, you're, I'm you're, a you're. Saunter. Yeah, yeah, you saunter like a mofo. And I was just laughing to myself thinking about you in New York sauntering. <laughs> saunter like a mofo. <laughs> That's funny. That's something I haven't heard yet. Uh, many things. Dang it! Ah! No! I'll get him back. I'll get him back. I'll get him back. I'll get him back. I'll have to do my infinity boost to wait again. I will saunter to my post. Alrighty, we got this. I can do it this time. I can do it. Oh. There we go. Boosted! Oh, and it's about to come. <laughs> ben says, did it hurt when you were sucked into that vortex and that shadow ray dad? No, it was actually angry. <laughs> no, it, it, I mean, I guess if, if anything, I had to like run full speed and then like up. So I guess so. That's this thing not letting me change lanes. Oh, whatever. All right, Rainbow Road, let's go. Right, I can't go left or right. You good. This isn't good. It's not letting me change lanes. There it goes. All right, middle lane. No big. Right into it. A mass. A mass. Twice a mass. Oh. Uh, all right, I'm gonna get it. Uh, Hassan.
That's an itch. Hopefully, a healthy obsession? Healthy chicken buying obsession? <laughs> chicken supporting obsession? <laughs> Julie says, why don't eggs tell jokes? They'd crack each other up. <laughs> All right, do your little thing. Okay, see, I didn't jump before him this time. Amy, that is her name. Oh shit. That's a pink hedgehog. Amy. Oh no, Amy. <laughs> They've taken Amy. Got to run real fast and aerate some soil on my way. <laughs> Do you what? Do you smell that? What do you smell, man? <laughs> Essence of Amy. Happens? I don't get anything. Got like three rings. Uh, oh, there we go. Thanks. My here. All right. Well, let's go see what that red fortune guy is. It says I feel like a lot of us voted too fast. What was the? What are Rhonda's superpowers? Uh, the first one is sauntering like a mofo. <laughs> <laughs> the second one is ignoring the hater aid. Everyone's just chilling. Not even a G, just chilling. And then the fourth one is all of the above. Ooh. Oh. satisfying yeah <laughs> <laughs> like this game is like uh, and I, I know it's like shamelessly ripped off from breath of the wild like all kudos to those guys but man these do like make my brain chemicals like who is this person playing a very emotional piano I know. Thank you. Great job. Yeah. Oh shoot. Shut up. Here we go. Wait. Oh, what's that? Oh, we're doing the loop. Okay. Again? I forget. Okay. Wait. Okay. Red red thing in the sky. Red red sky torch. Ooh, are the squid. You coming right for me? Well, we can reach him. Can't really reach him. Get him. Oh no no no. Get distracted. Red thing. Right here. Over the red thing. Ooh, there's 
that guy. Do you think the day and night transition is quick? You know, it's hard to say. Because how long should it be? Yeah. <laughs> who, who, who am I to judge? <laughs> <laughs> how many apron DDTs have you taken? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. I felt like I've programmed enough day and night cycles to have an opinion here. <laughs> I, mean... I think it's if, if it's like a minute per hour, like, I don't know. I'm, I guess I'm fine with that. What's a minute per an hour? Like, like if each minute equals one hour and it's a 24 minute day night cycle, I'm down for that. Yeah. Yeah. So, so yeah, it's been that's what they did for Majora's Mask, I think. The whole yeah. reason we came was because or maybe even 48 minutes I think but it's, here, it's like right? two minutes per now I'm finding uh, digital keys and confinement towers that seem custom made to hold the emeralds like half this stuff was built with them in mind maybe the em ancients em em used em the chaos emeralds in the past we've learned of other past the civilizations ancients. who did too yeah but those groups tried to use them and the stuff here seems all about containment what if the Sheik... Maybe they knew something about their power that I mean, we don't. Agents. The Chaos Emeralds are still pretty mysterious. Even after all we've done with them. Amy, why are the Emeralds so mysterious, Amy? Alright. Wait. This is where we're trying to get to. Over there! Hey. I'm actually getting better at this. Uh, speaking of Liberace in the chat room, everyone should watch the final Elton John concert on Disney Plus. It's great. What? Liberace, yeah. I don't know. Someone was saying Liberace made the music to Sonic Frontiers. Oh, really? He did not. <laughs> he did not. <laughs> Let's get Liberace for this. I mean. <laughs> <laughs> Somewhere in Japan. Yeah. <laughs> in, yeah, some boardroom. Oh. <laughs> Liberace. Oh, uh, Liberace. <laughs> Those two? I don't know. I just keep collecting things that I don't really know what to do, but it makes satisfying sounds and they're shiny, so I feel good about it. Find exactly out. how I'm playing Raid. <laughs> yeah, I tried playing Raid while uh, breastfeeding Poe and like putting her sleep. I felt like I was missing out the sound off. Give you what you require. Miles B says it's a bucket list. Is it a bucket list dream team with Shayna win the tag titles? You would dominate. Uh, yes! I'm happy. Oh, I'm happy just having a tag title. I don't need singles title. Tag would fu be fun. I mean, both is cool, but. Alright, I've been doing singles for so long. I already changed that. For so long, like a year and a half. That's another thing too. People forget I've only had like a year and a half of engineering experience. Like shit. I'd like to see any of your favorites after a year and a half of starting. <laughs> I would love to actually see that and go back and look at what everybody else's gimmick was a year and a half after they started. What if everyone's like, well my favorite favorite's Kurt Angle? <laughs> it's like damn. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, <you're not. laughs> oh shit. Kurt, Kurt is like, yes. Like, for, for me, I'm like, whatever. He's the greatest, so. Yeah, I the right name, answer for uh, anything is Kurt Angle. And I'm like, what does true. Oyster Peanut mean? I'm like, Kurt Angle. What's the quadratic formula? Kurt Angle. <laughs> I'm correct every time. <laughs> What's the, when's the right time to wear a tan suit? Kurt Angle. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Him, this is a Wendy's. 
<laughs> I wasn't paying attention. I got hit. Oh, my rings, my rings, my precious rings. I'm curious about the ring storage. Where do they go? Ooh, they get on that. That's a spot where you come slow down. Down low is. Yep, that's right over here. Ah! Woohoo! Okay, it was like around here, right? That's not the same guy, is it? In the area. There was two of them. I just move on. Let's look at our map. I haven't even looked at this map. Um let's go to this exclamation point. Quick thing, Rhonda. Uh jumping on because I wasn't sure what um uh, who was it saying this? Uh, Nick Stasiak, um, cousin of Sean Stasiak. Speaking of Kurt, he goes excited to see him on Friday. I'm like, why is Kurt there on Friday? SmackDown is having a birthday celebration set for Kurt Angle on 12 9, Rhonda. Oh, yeah, we're in Pittsburgh. You're going to be there. Ah! It's oh, Pittsburgh. Sandra Garcia says she's been married over for three months to see you and Shantine again. It's so great. I hope both of you will be tag team champs soon. I'm expecting it'll be fun to watch. Oh my god, I'm so excited. It's gonna be Kurt Day. Here we go, in it. Put some hot in it. That's it. Hey, Actually, yo, Amy. Good. Who's your friend? Yo, in it. Who's your friend? Oh my god, it's a little gibberish. It's so cute. Like these guys are this total ripoffs of the coral. The, the new Kokiri. They've been too shy to express their feelings. They an, but if they don't do no, it now, no they may never get the chance. Oh, oh yeah, you didn't play Breath of the Wild. You got all nope. that, huh? I got it though. I feel like the dimension I'm in is translating for me. It's strange, but feels natural. Well, he always had a knack for weird insights. Who am I to argue? See, like, why is his nose like that? Name his nose. Reunite you with your lost love. You know why. Goodbye. <laughs> you got more issues, but again, <sighs> who am I to argue? It's called thousands of years of nature. Yeah, Andrew. <laughs> He's out of here. Hope it's uh, not a bad emergency and. Uh... Oh yeah, here's the dude. Hey, guy. Ah. Marshall Board Street. Oh, you have returned your email inside once more. Allow me to unlock the partnership you can order. Heather. Oh, you pinned rowdy places when I interviewed Kurt? Yep. Kurt is such a gentleman. They set up the seats where I had to be looking at was to it and he allowed me to do it like that. Now he is way better lit than I am, but I'm much more comfortable and that's because he's a freaking gentleman and I love him. Brandon said he ripped off song lyrics for me. Hmm. The, the lyrics to the song, Rhonda. Did you know that I have a song? What, what do you mean? This like guy. Is it hip hop? Yes. Yes, my cousin sent it to me. I, I he's like actually found a fan. it on a day that I just didn't expect it, and I was like crying. Really? That's it. awesome. I cried like ugly tears, and I was like, yeah, yeah, he's right. I need to come back and win like a Ronda Rousey. And I'm like, oh man. I just, it, it was. It was needed. Thank you. Oh, right that pose it by. We should pin it. I'll tell you right now. One second. Find it and pin it. So like, my good people literally. can support such such a caring and sweet artist. West Side Gun, G U N N. Hold on, let me go get it. Uh, one second. Oh God. 
Nothing. <laughs> Ooh, Azerte is French. You know what? I adore you too. Healing is. Oh. oh man, why, why, why? I was like trying to look at it. Cheers, hey, good change. <laughs> Delivery of exposition. I, I think Little Uzi Vert has another Rondo song. There's quite a few, really? but the most re yeah, they're, they're, you're mentioned in a lot. Uh, this is one that came out a month ago that my cousin sold me because this is super underground. Is it nice? So I think. Mean... No, it's nice. Okay, because Eminem says I got a flat little bit donk and I'm like, ah! that's it. <laughs> but first of all, it's an honor to be mentioned by Eminem. Like, <laughs> like getting arm barred by me, like even if it's not good, you better be lucky. Like if, even if it doesn't feel good, you're lucky that it happened to you. Um, but, like, I never thought of my butt as being flat. And I'm like, oh, well, you guys only see me at my butt really during weigh-ins when I'm all sucked out. Dehydrated. That's not the time to check on my butt. After weigh-ins, you check out my ass. <laughs> and it's like, what's this a pool? Yeah. You see, you, what you need to do is is release a track, like, at Eminem, a diss track, about that. Oh, I could never. But the thing is, I like my butt a lot. I always thought I had a great butt. I mean, you know. My my knee falling off hasn't really helped my leg development, but I still like it. I think it's cute. My husband likes my butt. Where's the squid? I'm lying in wait, squid. There's some purple coin. Oh, they're not coming. Oh, man. <sighs> Should I just give up on the squid? Just find something on the map to do next? Yeah, screw the squid. Find this guy again. He just keeps giving me power-ups. Slightly to the right. Babe, sexy. Oh, Coco and Elder Coco. I need to bring Coco and to the Elder Coco. He will be able to raise Sonic's top speed and maximum ring capacity. Oh, go to the Hermit Coco to change how he's upgraded. Yeah. Hey, dude. Oh, hello there. The name's the name's Sonic, and that says it all. Fast. You don't seem like the rest of these little mask guys. We stole from Breath of the Wild. We are called the Coco, not the, the Korok, okay? Get that straight. We have endured since ancient. My name has been lost in time, so please simply call me Turner Coco. It has been my job to look after the other little ones, but over time I've lost track of so many. Um, you suck at your job? Oh, Nick. May I ask you to return my charges to me? Two thing, Grams. If I see any while I'm helping my friends, I'll bring them back to you, brah. Oh, a true hero. I will happily reward you for your efforts. Let me see. I can do two things for you. Raise your speed or raise the maximum capacity of your rings. Ooh, let's do it. Yeah, she've already brought back so many safely. So shall we begin? What should we start with? Need. I've got a need for it. Need. I sped you up 
That's nice. No such thing as crash right. Do they more? More speed. Speed level raise. I mean, when do you ever really have 400 coins? And what do I even use the coins for besides not dying? You know what I mean? I never see 400 fly out of me. Okay, let's just keep getting faster so you won't run anymore. How many do I have? Oh, he's down here. Michelle Peeves is talking the gnome voice. Oh, God. You know, it's been a while since you're talking the gnome voice. And I do. I like to increase the speed. Going real fast. Harder. I need, sometimes I need to hear an actual gnome first, you know, and then it gets me gnome -y. I get into the gnome mode. Now I'm kind of halfway there. I don't know. Could be a dwarf. Hybrid. From the north. Oh god, maybe I need to hang it up. Let's get to that point for the day. Increasing our speed as much as we can and then we'll see how fast we are. Now I'm gonna freaking catch that squid! More speed. Okay, that was it. I don't know, do I seem that much faster to you? I don't know about that. I don't see the squid thing flying around anymore either, though. Okay, let us see. Where do we need to go? Are these things? Why don't they like show up with like explanations of what they are? They're just pictures of stuff. Well, I gotta do something over here to reveal that corner of the map. So. Oh, let's do the miles trick. Infinite on our asses! Infinity! And... No farther than that. <laughs> that was for me. Okay. Yeah. I need there. One thing I missed. Thank you, Joe. I love that match. I wish we could have done the thumbtacks, but I still loved it. Had a good time. Uh huh. Wow. So funny. Liv went to a UFC fight the other day, and she was like, "Oh my god, dude! It's like wrestling, but real. Like real faces and real hills." Oh my god. Basically, that's basically it. She's like, you're so nice to us, bro. You're like, totally kill me. <laughs> like, I didn't realize how nice you are to us until I saw, like, how much you could totally kill me. Like, I'm freaking kayfabe. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> there we go. I do have to admit I've been loving watching this weird uh, three-on-three MMA basketball in a cage. <laughs> Yeah, and it's like, you know... I feel like know, Trav would be amazing at that. Dude, I agree. I should send him the video because it is awesome. It reminds me of, like, stuff you would do as a kid in a basement, like, with, like, a small hoop. <laughs> it's oh just God. full oh, contact. God. It's crazy. Hey, have you heard about this? Three-on-three -three basketball? Uh, MMA. MMA in a cage? Yeah. Is there any money in it? 
because 100% Travis will be the fucking one to get Well, I believe we'll fit up for it. Found you, Amy. Here you go. <laughs> Heavy Hammer. Great screen name for that reference. <laughs> oh, wow. I don't think we've seen any ruins quite like this on our adventures. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they're ancient, but also look kind of advanced. Wait, is retro sci fi a thing? How were oh, the tower retro and the sci -fi giant thing. stone built? Tails is the genius among us. Let's find him and see if he can figure things out. Right, I found right. it. Tails is the I'm genius. I'm sure he'll hang on until I find him. Michelle's like, more gnome. More gnome. I need more gnome boys, I swear. What? Oh, you found the basketball thing? Yeah. I pinned it. The last of the hmm. cool giant mirror web thing. Ooh. Why? When did Sonic become this like bro? Some more Kiri over there. Oh, I'm sorry. Whatever the rip off thing is, Coco Pearls. Trust Dr. Eggman. Hey. Oh, come on. I was hitting it. I was hitting it. That's some bullshit. Bit of the map. I know I'm being completionist over this and I shouldn't.
Oh, Alejandro says, thank you for your streams. They entertain me a lot and disconnect me from my problems. Same here, man. We're, we're all here for the same reason. <laughs> I'm really happy to hear you enjoy it, though. Where do I gotta go? Where are we going? Um, speaking about loving your stream, Rhonda, uh, Hades is on sale for 50% off across <gasps> many different digital storefronts. So, definitely one of our favorites you should play. Also, Horizon Zero Dawn is 67% off on Steam for PC. What? Uh-huh. Um, it's just a lot of good games happening right now. Uh, including, uh, Tunic, which I want Rhonda to play eventually. Tunic? Um, is that the one with the foxes? Yeah, it's a uh, Souls-like Metroidvania style, um, and people really like it. That's 20% off right now on Steam. So, go support your indie developers. Play some I games do, Ron uh, likes. Indie developers. Yeah. That's the one. Probably. Ah, might be time to call it though. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Michelle, I'm so sorry. I'm oh, so sorry. sorry to hear. I'm so, so sorry, Michelle. Oh, we're here for you. You know, if you ever want to talk about it or not talk about it, or just come here as like an escape from everything, you know, um, just let us know. You know, whatever you need from us, we'll be it. Oh, Michelle, I'll let you call it. We were going to sign off right now, but what do, what do you want to do? What do you want to do, Michelle? We're going to do it right now. You want me to go after that squid thing? You want to go? You want some beef stroganoff? <laughs> let me know. Michelle, you cannot request an Eminem diss track, though. Yeah, that is fine. You can do that. Okay. But, um... What was Michelle's favorite charity? Wasn't it, it was it Autism Speaks or was it another one? I feel like it was Autism Speaks. Maybe see if I can look back. Let's put that one up for her. Hopefully yep, anybody, uh, Autism Speaks. Anybody feeling charitable wants to do something in the, in the name of the great Michelle Speaks. Consider. Michelle, please confirm that it was Autism Speaks, because I remember there was one that you really liked and one you didn't like. It was Autism Speaks. Okay, cool. Okay, Michelle says to keep going. I'm going to keep going. And I'm pinning Autism Speaks. If anyone would like to make a donation. In Michelle's name. Did you guys ever like watch your siblings or anyone like game when you were a kid, the original streaming? 
I was a big time game watcher. Oh, yeah. I enjoyed watching more than like. Who did you usually have to watch play games? Uh, my sister Jen, actually, who doesn't play games at all now. <laughs> Interesting. Like, set the stage. What was being played? Oh god, I cannot for the life of me remember what it was. And I've been trying to figure out forever. It was like a Zelda ripoff game. And, um... Quest 64. No, it was before I played Quest 64. It was terrible. Um, but I loved it. I love certain things about it, but in general it's terrible. Um, even the, I remember even reading the walkthrough for Quest 64, and the person who made the walkthrough was like, this game is absolute dog shit. I can't believe that I finished it. And if you are reading this now, I really hope that you don't pursue this game. But if you do, here's the walkthrough. Just like that. I have done this for you. There we go. Oh, Barry Tibbins says when he goes live tonight on TikTok, he'll donate all his battles to the cause. That's so sweet. Thank you, Barry. Right, no emerald bra. What's this? Oh, I did it all. Yeah. Right, I'm this way. Can you beep? What's the map say? What does the map say? I'm gonna go down to the lowest. Okay. I know you're my guys. I don't understand why a little fan club shows up every time I... That's kind of weird. I must have skipped that exit. the map. says me to browse you on TikTok. I can't, man. Can't do it. I usually try to be all on top of. 
speed to ring capacity. Ring capacity. Oh, you can like move it around. No, no, no. I don't understand. This. Closer? Oh, it just did a uh, braille. Did you see that? Oh. Maybe I need to do this again. Look at that! That's it? Is there like another one? One god. <laughs> get out there. Like this one's connected, so you can push it to go over here. Okay, I think you're on to something. Push it. Get the rod go this way. What does it do? Oh. Aha! I'm missing gas. Oh, maybe this thing. Yep. Oh, can't see. We're on it. We're on it. No, we're on it. Excuse me. How the something? Is it right above it? Oh my 
Get it now. I got it. Dear media, I love practical jokes, and that was one of my favorite nights in a long time. What? He goes, Obscure Media Emporium goes, I'm still shook from you trolling us on the stream the night of the rumble. Twilight Princess ripoff. How are you able to return from cyberspace so freely? I don't know. I guess I'm just that awesome. <laughs> yeah. <Caught. clears throat> Although, I bet you'd have better insight on that. I will not share data with the enemy. Besides, your survival may be a fluke. You cannot cheat fate forever. Wow, you like the game so far, Joshua. Encouragement. I'll keep doing it until I figure out how to rescue Amy. Yeah, it doesn't matter if this is all one big trap or if you keep throwing weird robots at me, nothing's gonna slow me down or stop me. I love the on the nose Count dialogue. On, on the nose. On the phallic nose. Is it Knuckles? The Twilight Princess is Knuckles? Alright guys, let's do some models. Let's do it. Ooh, you're on the second island? There's more islands. Just one island and many, how many islands? Roderick, I feel the exact same way as you do about the sonic voice. It really pulls you out of it. Nice. I can't even believe that. I have to blow that. Gotta get all the rings though. Okay. 
right, let's get that last gold coin. <laughs> Human Manipulation Nation says, okay, so I posted a short of coolest woman on the planet talking about Sonic's phallic nose. Highlight of my day, thanks. <laughs> oh, Ashton Banks, welcome. Congrats on your one month. Supporting. Where did you post it, Human Manipulation Nation? Yeah, let us know. Um, and for cool people like Ashton, that's a member, we do members only streams sometimes. When mostly when I just well, it's just nice to have like a group where every, we know everybody's names. And we have like a rapport. I mean, it's great. Like our group now, these other streams, but that's how it. Oh, I just completely killed it. Happened. Found it. No. Um. But yeah, it's just a nice, calmer feel. Just, you know, you get to know everybody's names and to, like catch up, stuff like that, see everyone's been doing, and then like a much more intimate setting. And then, which I love very much. A little less trolly, a little less uh, work for Jason to moderate. A little less trolly on my mind. A little less. <laughs> but the thing is, too, like, it's just people want to show up and be a jerk. They gotta be a jerk. If people want to show up and use the excuse to, like, write articles or whatever. Five dollars. <laughs> you want to be a mole? If you want to be a jerk, you gotta. Be a jerk. <laughs> And it's not because I need five dollars or I'm just like I think. It's fireball. Yeah. Uh -huh. There we go. Now I got the first win. Now we got them all. Oh, a helicopter. I, I didn't even know it. Be wearing goggles, I think. Uh, right? What graphics... do you do with all that wind? Yeah, and like his graphics get better. Like, let's make his lips flat. <laughs> this is nice. Yeah. That's all that matters. Alright. My hands are sweaty. Baby's about to wake up from a nap. Mom's oh, spaghetti. Guys. Sorry, I had to bring that back to Eminem. Is it time? I was like, Eminem, thank you for having me your song. Sorry, you don't. I don't have my 
That's only for my husband to know. Yeah. Um, yeah. I will connect. the thing. Nope. All right. Uh... <laughs> Joshua knows it. He's got it. Me is weak. Arms are heavy. <laughs> like, hey, man, let's go. I have not been to Mom's Spaghetti, Joshua, but now I kind of want to. Oh, I forgot about that. That's so funny. Is that in Michigan? I should go. I don't know. Roll 89 is asking when we're playing Raid, and I think it's on the we don't know yet officially. Okay, we're. Yeah. Breaking keyfame. Constantly. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. They want things to be secret. I don't know. Just everyone to know. Yeah, we're advertising the game. They're supposed to know. <laughs> I I've don't the know. <laughs> the whole point is telling people. I think it's going to be next week. Possibly a week from today. It's not 100% sure. Yeah. A lot of emails have to get. Oh, well, thank you, everybody who joined in and uh, hit the little bell or notify uh, you know, whenever we're going live. Dreams. And uh, thank you, everybody who donated today. That's really cool. And um, if you would like to. Donate and actually get something for it. Please go buy our chicken. That's where all the money's going. Um, yep. Guys, um, we're actually like lifting my meat at after having waking up at having big God the DDT. So I just needed um positive. Well, <clears throat> thank you for providing it. Love you guys. And I will see you all very soon. Any final notes, Jason? Uh, no notes. <laughs> no notes. That's all.